Sean Puffy Combs. Y'all should have known something was wrong with Mr. Combs when he named himself Puffy. What nigga named himself Puffy? Let's start there. He switched it to P. Diddy. Then he switched it to Brother Love. You had to be a blind person to kind of see that. You already know the deal. Why are you being low key though? Because I feel like I'm waking people up. I'm going to keep it a thousand. But I'm not going to touch on this long. I just want to say the chicken have finally come home to roost. I think that's the saying. Uh, I don't really touch on subjects like this much, but if I am going to touch on the subject, who didn't see this coming, bro? Let's keep it at that. Who didn't see this coming? You knew since Puffy, Puffy was doing that shimmy, something was going on, bro. One may argue that Puffy has single-handedly ruined R&B. What do you mean, Keto? The group 112. Faith Evans. Danny DeCain. He even made people walk to get a cheesecake. Puff Daddy should have been locked up for that cheesecake alone. But hey, that's neither here nor there. This is all I got to say on it. It's a lot of Puffies. It's not just Puffy or P. Diddy, whatever you want to go by. It's a lot of them. I've been in this music professionally since 1999. My friends used to ask me, Keto, your music sound better than everybody on the radio. Everyone, except Tupac. They was like, bruh, why you not on? Now me, being in Atlanta, one of the meccas, I sound like a nigga with an excuse. Cause I'm like, bruh, you can't, it ain't just that. How big do you want to be? When Dave Chappelle said, you got to know your price. I knew my price. And once I, again, had the meeting with Universal, I came out of that as a songwriter. I didn't even want to rap. I've been rapping my entire life until shit got real. I asked Universal for five million. Universal took the meeting. The meeting got so weird that I said, damn, they lied to me. It's not about my talent. It's about what I want to compromise. To each in his own. I'm not compromising my buttocks. Hell no. I don't even want money that bad. Who the hell want money that bad? I don't want money that bad. I'm not even that. One may argue I'm not the best money manager. So you mean to tell me P. Diddy done fondled with your, um, with your little Chick-fil-A nuggets <laughs> and you still broke? Come on, bro. That's how people jump off balconies, bro. You let P. Diddy fungle with your Chick-fil-A nuggets, and now you still working at Staples. Hell no. Hell no. This is why a lot of people to be depressed, stressed out in the game, because you have to wonder, what did you compromise? I can honestly say, right hand, left hand to God, I ain't never compromised nothing. Damn, why is it going to start following me? Then the camera immediately go to the ball cam. I've been turning this off, bro. Hold on, man. Let me turn this off. Man, I hate this camera, bro. This... This camera is the feds, bro, because I turned this gesture shit off and it keep turning itself back on, which is weird. Fucking weird, bro. But anyhow, what do you want to compromise? I don't want to compromise. I can't compromise. I'm sorry. I don't want to be, I don't want fame and I don't want money that bad to compromise something that's going to fuck up my sleeping patterns for the rest of my internal existence, eternal existence. I'm not, hell no. I'm straight. I'm good, bro. I don't even want to do it with a girl that I don't like for money because she gonna know I don't like her. It's gonna be fake. I can't be fake, bro. I'm a realist. So when people used to ask me in the game, Keto, what is it like to, I mean, can you help my son or, or daughter get on? I'd be thinking like, you want your daughter and son in this industry? You'll be better off going the little Boosie method. It's some people that didn't have to compromise and you can almost tell who they are. You'll be surprised at some of the ones who did. But when I see somebody like a Lil Boosie, hate him, love him, whatever it is, Lil Boosie is pimping the hell out that chilling circuit. Why? He never have to come across P. Diddy's. He probably don't have Rick Ross money, but he got enough money to sustain uh, his lifestyle. He, it, everything come with a price. What do you want to compromise? I'm straight. I don't even want money. Hell no. I'd rather go on YouTube. What's up, YouTube? Intro, nigga, I do that. Fuck that. So, I don't know, man, but I need to know y'all thoughts on it, but who didn't see this coming with Puffy? Last thing I'm going to say about this, I'm going to say this, man. Ooh. I don't want to say it, but I got to keep it a thousand. And me, this just kind of knowing humans. 
I don't see Puffy doing no time long. He not doing time long. And what I mean by that is, uh, I don't want to be the person to say it like that. Uh, I don't see Puffy having the mental fortitude to go from a private jet, hundreds of millions of dollars, a billionaire, to life in prison. What do you think he's going to do? I don't want to say it because I don't want to speak that on nobody, but I, I, one may question how long he will be. Uh, I don't want to say it on earth, man. I'm going to keep it right. Uh, how long Pete Diddy going to be on earth? Because everybody can't go through that, and I don't think he had a mental fortitude. If he did like to be fond of wit with people Chick-fil-A nuggets, then it's a lot of customers where he going, where he at right now. The problem is when you used to what you used to, I can't see him doing that time. Not life. Think about that. He can't, I don't think he have the mental fortitude to do what R. Kelly doing. R. Kelly doing his time. In fact, I heard R. Kelly doing concerts in prison. He done embraced it. He done embraced it. But I don't know. Hop in the comment section. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, did you see this coming? Is this surprising to you? Do you think the most important question is, do you think P. Diddy has the mental fortitude to actually serve the time that he's going to be received? Or do you think the latter part that I said that he probably don't have longer here? However, one may say he might not be suicidal or anything like that. One may argue that he's going to get the same J. Epps the, the EP treatment. You know what I mean? Because there's too many powerful people that was on that list. And if P. Diddy did record powerful people such as a prince, such as such as politicians, such as music execs, uh, movie execs, actors, lawyers, doctors, and how high profile people, it's going to be hard for him to be here long. They're going to take care of it. One of the reasons they can lock you up because they can isolate you and it make you easy. You can't be on a private jet to Tahiti we gonna come get you in that cell. That's how they do it, bro. So again, don't shoot the messenger. That's all I got on that topic right there, man. And we about this thing, man. Be sure to like and subscribe, share. Nah, hell no. Nah. Don't share this. Fuck that. Don't share this. Hell no. Nah. We out. Outro. Take me down. Baby, look at fly like some millionaire. Just name a place we can take it down. Shots got us.